What's up, Nigs? How's everybody doing? I'm here at the beautiful Meadow Lark Gardens, just outside of McLean, Virginia. Check it out, everybody. Been enjoying the greenery, the flora, the flana, if you will. Got a little bit of, got a little bit of uh, solitude here, so I thought I'd made a video. Thought I'd make a little video for everybody. Um, haven't been getting much sleep lately, guys, so I'm feeling a little bit. Uh, drag assy if you will man look at these fucking lily pads dude look at this i love lily pads man they're so pretty so pretty so i just wanted to, wanted to talk about a couple new things going on um you know so all right so look like a couple days ago i got an email from a gentleman who goes by the combat mechanic and i've gotten emails from this guy in the past and he you know talked about anthony bourdain and all that bullshit and he told me that the fact that my that the comment sections on my videos <clears throat> have been disabled for for a long time now makes my videos less interesting to watch. Now, is that true? Are my videos less interesting? Are my videos do do my videos lack substance and quality simply because people are unable to comment? I I disagree with that. I think that my that has nothing to do with my videos, but. It got me thinking, you know, yeah, why, why, why do I have the comments disabled? So, I decided to enable the comments, so it, I, I pretty much enable the comments on every single video that I have, so people can comment from here on out. Basically, the reason that I disabled comments in the past was because I had one or possibly more people impersonating members of my family... Um, and spreading false information and basically defacing me. Defacing me and my family, namely my mother. Now, as you all know, I love my mother very much and I have zero sense of humor about people fucking with her and anybody in my family, so I simply disabled the comments. I did not disable the comments because people were hurting my widow feelings. I didn't I did not disable the comments because people were talking shit and saying mean things. I it has nothing to do with it because people have been talking shit about me and hurting my little feelings since I've been making videos in Phnom Penh, Cambodia, y'all. So I just wanted to let everybody know that um and then basically it just got to the point where 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 I just I just didn't think anything of it and and I just left the comment section disabled. So people are now free to comment on any video that I put out from here on out and in the past where the comments were disabled. Now, on to the next. Man, look at look at it. Look at this, man. Isn't that, isn't that pretty, man? I love Virginia, dude. Virginia is so pretty in the summer. Look at that. Isn't that pretty, y'all? You guys are ever in Virginia, man. Check it out. Meadow Lark Gardens in McLean, Virginia, y'all. It's kind of near like the Wolf Trap Center where they play concerts and all. I digress, everybody. I digress. Yes. Um, apparently, people are talking shit about my new woman. Now, that's that's you know that's 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 to be expected. Um, I I personally don't read the comments. I personally don't don't read the comments, but she did. And apparently people are calling her an old bag, saying she's ugly and old and she won't show her face. Well, look, that's fine. Now, listen, y'all. Do you, do you really think me? Check this out. Me. Come on, look. Look at my pretty blue eyes. Come on. Do y'all do y'all honestly think that I would be dating some old wrinkly ass bitch? Do you guys honestly think that I'd be with some old bag? No. No thanks, man. Now, is she older? Yes, yeah, she is older than me. Substantially older. The cool thing about my woman is that is that she could get with any woman up, uh, any woman. She <laughs> she could get with any man she wants. Now, she is very very, let's say, well respected in her in her industry of work. She's very very um, let's just say you know, very successful in her endeavors in life. And she happens to be very, very attractive. And I've been all over the D.C. area with her. I've been to New York City with her. And young men and older men of different colors, walks of life, whatever you want to call it, routinely check her out right in front of me. She's a fucking MILF, dude. She's a fucking hottie. 
She's older, but she's very, very beautiful. However, the reason I don't show her in my videos is because she doesn't want to be in my videos. She's very private. She's a very private person. She's a very, very private person. She does, she does not want to be seen on the videos. And I respect that. And, and honestly, I'd prefer to keep her out of the videos. You know, the last time that I was in a relationship was with a transgender woman named Chiba. Chiba in Phnom Penh, Cambodia. And she met me through my videos just like my current girlfriend did. And it, we, we came to a point where Chiva, the Cambodian girl, and I, we decided to make a video together about, it's called How I Met My Transgender Girlfriend. And it's still up. It's one of my most watched videos that I've ever put out. And that was the beginning of the end of our relationship. For the next couple of weeks, we made, we made several videos together because people knew that she was, you know, quote unquote, a lady boy, a, tra a transgender, whatever. And that was the beginning of the end of our relationship. She, she, she started to get uh, obsessed with the things that she said in the videos and, and, and it, you know, she, she, she started to like regret being in the video because people were saying mean things, but a lot of people were saying very nice things. She would go into the comment section and read the comments and get all up in arms about it. So I even disabled comments before because of that. And I noticed that her having her in my videos actually kind of fucked up our relationship. So learning from that, from here on out, I'd prefer not to have the person that I'm romantically involved with, or whatever you want to call it, sexually involved with, in my videos. Now, will my beautiful woman, Ana E, be in my videos in the future? Perhaps. Perhaps. But as of now, no. She's very, very private. So anybody thinking that I'm dating some old, wrinkly-ass bitch... I mean, you guys can say what you want, but the fact of the matter is, no matter who I'm with, y'all motherfuckers are going to talk shit. That's just a fact. So I just wanted to make this video to let everybody know that I enable the comments. Feel free to comment, and I hope everybody has fun with that, man. So, anyways, guys, I'm walking around enjoying the flora and fauna, if you will, of beautiful northern Virginia. It's fucking gorgeous out here, man. Like I said, check it out, man. Meadowlark Gardens, McLean, Virginia, y'all. If you guys want to shoot me an email, no joke striking at gmail.com. Bitches. Fuck Instagram. Hit me up on Facebook, y'all. Facebook.com slash no joke coward. All the links will be in the description box below. Peace.